Lipo is a beautiful place. And two coves away in Barangay Magsaysay, limestone casts rise from the ocean in an El Nido-like setting. Natural beauty despite the rainy days. And then, can I make it to Maragusan? Many hours and one ferry ride away, in times for my friend's business blessing. Ooh, then I fit. This is insane. I don't know what's going to be going on today. Let's try and do something. I need to get some air at the back of my tyres there. The, the, the tyres have enough air for loaded and I'm going unloaded and I'm going down some rough roads so I need to get the air out. I'll work this out. Mad. Oh, crap. And once I got out of the flood, I found a place to fix the air in my tyres. I found a place under a roof, I can operate my compressor and get this down to 33 from 40. Actually first I parked under the one bit of roof that's not replaced. The road to Barangay Magsaysay is half finished and eventually comes out in a landscape of casts, not unlike Palawan. Magsaysay looks a little like El Nido from the air and its narrow streets are interesting to drive on. <laughs> oh. I'm, I'm hoping to go through here. We're in Barangay Magsaysay, which is on the other side of the big peninsula in Libho. And the garbage collection truck and an umbrella are blocking my path. It's always interesting. <laughs> Thank you, Arsene. <Wasing. laughs> so I parked up and used the streets in a more appropriate way by walking. Let's get up. This is a... Mad Payong mission. We're walking somewhere here, somewhere here. It's a place called Jilmars, which is a little islet and it looks a little bit like Palawan. It looks nice. Mud dag. So they had to rebuild all of this after the typhoon, after Odette. All of this was just wiped out and it's just, uh, it's good that they've been able to do this now. I really hope the weather clears up a bit. There are two resorts here, Luta's on dry land and Jelmar's on the islet. of this water really really beautiful which is on a little islet here they used to be floating cottages and all sorts this has been rebuilt in the last three months just since the typhoon hit and it's just such a beautiful beautiful view really beautiful I wish it wouldn't rain so much we've actually come here because I'm looking at where to make the boats um, there's a guy over in Albo there were apparently some guys here, but I can't find them. So I'm probably going to stick with the guy over there. Uh, I'm also trying to work out where exactly to give the boats to. That's always difficult because there's always need for them. So let's, let's see, let's see. Parts I haven't brought, of course, is the wood. The good thing is a lot of the old casco, as they called it, the base, a lot of them are still here. And I, I see one still tied up right here. There's a lot of these bases still exist and 
can still be used. So I might buy them off the, the fishermen and use them. Let's see, let's see what the guys say there. I'll work it out. <laughs> I noticed she actually plants a lot. There's some turmeric over here. There's some chili. Everything's planted. Lots of little gifts here. Salin Sadatu. It sounds expensive from the fact it has Datu in the name. Looks good. That's a good fish. I realized I was zoomed in on my face when I was recording that, so that's gonna look a bit dull, but there we go. With the weather unpredictable, ocean fierce, and needing to go back sooner than expected to talk to the boat builder, I'll have to explore this beautiful landscape more in the future. But here are a few highlights from afar. take a ride back over now definitely definitely going to explore this area a lot more soon I'm gonna go out to the lagoons there's another hidden lagoon around the back so many places and it does it looks so much like Palawan with the limestone casts before the typhoon so it's all been put back together, right? Eh? Wow. Salamak Aywa. Bye bye, bye bye. We're gonna go down and speak to the uh, the boat builder. He was actually waiting for us earlier. We had no signal. Didn't know. Hi, oh, okay, now I'm going to ask you now. Are you? Tap on. Ah, to now we go. Oh, in Ghana. I'm gonna form it. Oh, I'm gonna. What put on that? I'm gonna. Oh, I'm gonna slide, Debbie. Oh, oh. I'm gonna go. Oh, I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Oh, I'm gonna. 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 I'm the fisherman actually refused to take payment, so I vowed to pay it forward soon. But tonight, another mission. Right, we are going because it's Capitan of Barangay Albo's birthday. The guy with the super cool motorbike. And Kula said, here's this, get some tandoi for him. So, okay, there we go, let's buy some tandoi. <laughs> They've run out of lap ads, which is how much this town loves tandoi. And they know the lap ad tastes different. So we've got lechos. Okay, ra, to lo tapos na ikuan, lap ad. Yeah! <laughs>
the next day, 400 kilometers of driving plus a ferry trip to come. But not this ferry. Hello. Hello, hello, hello. hello. It's silly o'clock in the morning. I've got a ferry to catch because I've got a mission. A short visit this time to an awesome town, but I'll be back. I don't know if it was here or somewhere on this section, there was a landslide yesterday and they were saying, are you sure you're gonna get out? But they, s I don't know. I think they've cleared it. I hope they've cleared it. Otherwise, good luck to the world. I just went up that ridiculous hill and spoke to the guy. He said, go inside the port and he'll come there in a while to do the tickets. So let's see how that works out. Chief, one tag. Ah, morning. Ah, we saw Kaiko, we saw Kwanza Bako. We don't see Tata, we saw Lotko, we saw Kwanza, we saw Kwanza, we saw Kwanza, we saw Kwanza, we saw Kwanza. We saw Kwanza, we saw Kwanza. We saw Kwanza, 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 I didn't catch this on camera, but a very loaded bongo came off here, started shaking like this. I wondered if it was going to fall over. The boat's here. I've got to pay for the PPA first. We're, uh, we're going back to Dabo. I was slightly worried this wasn't going to work out, but it has. It has. It's worked out all right. going to be a rainy trip I think but let's go to Maragusan first I need some sabao or something this is apparently a very good bulalu the problem is I can't park anywhere so I'm going to find some bulalu somewhere else not here <laughs> I'm now several times away in a place I have no idea what the name is. I still haven't found Bulalu. And if I end up in the 7 Eleven in Kabad Baron or however on earth you say that, then I'm just gonna laugh at myself. And in Bayugan City, I finally found my crypt tonight. Bulalu time. Come on, let's go and Bulalu. Bulalu. Ah. Oh, okay. So, this is this is what. Oh, this is this is a good. Okay, I'm human again. So this section in Agus Andel, sir especially the Banao and Trento section is the bit that really takes the time. It's very potholed, a lot of it's still two lanes. Big contrast to when we hit Davao de Oro, as they now call it, Compostela Valley, uh, which is a province where it's just a wide six lane highway. the Bunturan, the road rises through this magnificent valley as we climb towards Maragusan.
You're the logo. You're the logo. <laughs> it's a spitting image. Huh? Oh. <laughs> I'm falling over chairs so many. I've been on the road for many, many hours. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> and I beat Kulas. Oh. Kulas well, is very slow. Still in your bataan. Rabi. No! <laughs> That's a good angle, eh? Hello, <laughs> uh, wow! I'm so excited that you guys are playing uh, Commander's Talent Fee to be here. <laughs> I hope you buy it. Oh. It's Talent Fee, it's three beers. I, I actually paid for the first one. I said, yes, spaghetti, so spaghetti, you don't know. Very long. Okay. But apparently I look fresh, even though I woke up at five o'clock this morning. Fresh the snooze button so many times there was no more snooze buttons left. And then I thought you were going to get out later. Yeah. You drove. You drove. And then report full report of your mission in Dinagat Island. Buying patroller, buying patroller. Mission in Dinagat, successful. Successful mission in Dinagat, buying patroller, buying patroller. How about I... What I tell, told you? Huh? Mission, uh, it's not successful. Uh. Buying patroller, madman is mad. Buying patroller, buying patroller. Ah, buying patroller, buying patroller. I have a new cameraman. Madman is my new cameraman. Mother, madman, mother. Oh, mother. Buying patroller. Oh, we've got to do a selfie with five. With, with. Buying patroller, buying patroller. Buy patroller. <laughs> focus on my mission, buying patroller. <laughs> I'm not focused at all. I'm trying to focus. Buying patroller, buying patroller. We're taking oh, that, a selfie. One, buy one, one more, Tina. Do one more selfie. One more selfie. <laughs> <laughs> selfie. Okay, okay. Go, Tina. Buying patroller. You go, Tina. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Are you gonna go behind the scenes? He's wearing the same shirt. I'm sure I'm, I'm gonna be the mascot. Okay, this is like My nipples are out. That's amazing. <laughs>